Here we go, round one. Scheduled for 12, IBF welterweight championship. Felix Trinidad. I think it's a good fight. And both greatly talented and well said. The champion Trinidad with the red and blue stripes down the sides. Process. It's going to be a serious case of speed and slipperiness against, albeit they were very, very nominal. Down goes Trinidad. Well, just like the last fight, he was down in the second round and came back. And get up so clear-headed. 13th edition of my life. So here in round two, and early in round two, Oba Carr sending Trinidad to the count. Carr has that Yuri Boy Compass did not have is an excellent defense and great speed. Dangerous way to operate, though. It was kind of like Floyd Patterson. Speed like a bullet. The reason it kills you is because it's going so fast. These quick punches. Keeping his distance. He's no fool. Less than 30 seconds, round two. Covered from that flash knockdown wholeheartedly, it seems. He does have the great heart, as we mentioned before, and a great finishing kick. Oh, there's a hard left hand by Trinidad. About to pounce on Obakar. And that this thing could turn fast. I think Obakar is getting that. Obakar is so quick, he springs forward, and that's how he caught Trinidad in the first place. Chopping right by Salas, the third man of the ring. It was like a, a taskmaster, a tough yeah. teacher. Yeah. Sometimes his tongue gets all shots. They're both good young guys with tremendous reflexes. The right hand again. And it was a right hand that put Trinidad down early in the second. He's back 24 0 with 20 knockouts. Oh, there it is. Right hand by Trinidad. Momentarily dazed Carr, but Carr fresh. See what Carr did there? He rolled with that punch. He took a little of the power up. Right hand again, overhand right by Trinidad. If Obercar doesn't land something hard to change this thing around, he's going in the wrong direction. And now Trinidad working the jab. That's three straight beautiful jabs. Two cat-like uh, fighters here. His best punch thus far. There's that left again by Trinidad, that jab. The that is the idol of many. Sure is, but uh, the most... Chavez and a rugged opponent, Tony Lopez. But right here, I think... It's not working for him. Carr's got to come back with the left hook, Ferdy, and throw a few more combinations. Look, Combination look by Trinidad. Look at that speed. So quick. Tell you what, that right hand off the side of Carr seemed to do much more than... He is so busy right now. Lefts and rights by Trinidad. He's in round five. Right hand by Trinidad. Oh, gate from Trinidad. Now a little holding by Carr. Well, I don't know. Ooh, a left hand by Trinidad. Everything I'm making it dead even. Felix Trinidad coming off an ex... You can see Obercar trying to set up that right hand again. That got in. Now another good left hook by Carr beginning to come up. The ball so quick and they jump in and out and miss punches. Ooh, what a nice uppercut. The difference is that the momentum is on a good left Trinidad. So. Trinidad with a left hand, but Carr showing a good chip. It was a good clean left, and then they what? Carr, to his credit, came back with a couple himself. Carr, 32 and 0, 20 knockouts, his first world title shot. He's popping in there, is taking effect. Oh, nice right shot. hand to the head by Trinidad. He's got everything. He's got straight right hands, he's got hooks, he's got uppercuts. Has the entire repertoire. There's a good left. But on his attitude and his resilience and his heart, you got to find out just what he's made of. I know what Carr wants to win. Whoa, whoa. But Carr able to come back. He got Trinidad's attention quite well right there. What a flurry to end this round, which may have ended just five seconds early. We still have Panama having the edge and speed and boxing ability right now. Well, Panama Lewis has a good reputation as a tremendous conditioner. Oh, I saw these oh, guns. Yeah. Carr over the years, just like you said, Bobby, before th that punch right there. Now to Trinidad to regain his composure and a right hand by Trinidad. But Carr unloading, fighting back. Well, Carr is forced now. He's cornered. He's forced to fight. He's a wounded. Enemy. Round seven, scheduled for 12. But he's shot with the left hand. Right. Look at him measure the right. And still, he gets a hook instead. Right hand. Oh, systematic. There's a nice left hook and another one, but it's one at a time. He's oh. got to follow with the right. But a left counter and a right by Trinidad. That sends him reeling into the ropes. Combination to the head. Carr. And it's coming right in front of us. She got the break once again. That has been the bone of contention throughout. I should have said that again in Spanish to Trinidad because I'm not sure he understood. I just off now anyway. It's academic.
Got to get out of the way of the big right hand and that jab. Good right hand by. <laughs> Left hand flush on the face on 13 seconds in a round two, but he has dominated from that point on. This punch is not penetrating by Carr. Good defense. They're being caught by the gloves of Trinidad. And he's throwing it in front of his face. And he doesn't get hit flush. When he does, he seems to take it. Oh, there he goes. Carr down to the canvas for the first time of the fight. Very wobbly. Big right up. Now he goes up for the finish. Down he goes again. He walked into a tremendous right hand. It was a great. Trinidad goes right back in. Combination of that blood spurting fight. And so Gonzalez steps in. It's all over. It's all over. Felix Trinidad remains undefeated. And this, the first defeat in Obacar's professional career. And Damas y caballeros, tenemos el tiempo. Dos minutos, 41 segundos in round number ocho. Ladies and gentlemen, with the time of two minutes, 41 seconds in round number eight, the referee stops the contest. El referee terminó la pelea. El ganador por knockout técnico. The winner by way of technical knockout and still champion, el invicto, Felix Tito Trinidad.